a glorious day here in um, North Queensland. Uh, I'm going to Maiden the uh, Wing Wing Z84 for the first flight today. Looking forward to this, a bit nervous too I tell you, you got a fair bit of, fair bit of investment spent. And the um, last thing you want to see is it to, to be destroyed on its first flight. So I've gone all over the precautions. I've double checked all my my uh, auto modes. So everything's running good from what I can see. Um, so there's no reason it should fail. I've just got it sitting here at the moment. Everything's on running. Um, just to pick up some satellites. It's It's got nearly 20 satellites at the moment. So it's good. I'm going to just give it a quick quick throw up um, and then servo trim it and we'll land and then I'll try a um oh actually I'll servo trim it and we'll do a, a loiter as well in in stable mode and maybe a return to home and that'll be about it for the day
beautiful. That was a real surprise. That it flew extremely well. Um, things are a bit wet because it's quite damp out in the field here. Um, hopefully everything went good with my run cam and the recording started there, but that was that worked well. I didn't push the battery too much. Um, it wasn't exactly fully charged, which is a bit of a no-no. I should have charged it right up, but it tested out perfect. Return to home worked. Um, the 50 meter radius, which I put on there, was worked well, working well. Um, it did go to land, which I pulled out of that, which I think that's not a bad option, especially if it's out of sight and way up very high, you want it to come down. If you've got no uh, um, video feed for some reason. Uh, the loiter worked good, 50 meter loiter. The return to home was also set to 50 meters high. Um, cruising speed seemed pretty good. Um, got it down to about 40 kilometers an hour. It was still flying nicely, it was, so... Um, very happy, very very happy with its first performance. So what we'll do is go back home I'll go and check some of the info that came up on the screen um, I've still got to get different uh, Different these these magnets are no good. They're too weak So I had to tape the canopy down because it was frightened it was going to blow off And that was not what I want to do considering the receivers on top And the props behind So yeah, it's a very successful start so thumbs up for iNav 2.5, that's what's running in it at the moment, upgraded to that. Um, so yeah, the next step will be just to, we'll give it another fly out here again, we might go, try and test its limits a little bit more, and go from there. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye for now.